All right, number one, we're gonna do some body work. So we gotta wash our hands up really good. At least 20 seconds. to touch the handle that I just touched with dirty hands. Um, so I'm going to use another paper towel to turn that off. Put that in the garbage. Okay. I'm missing body work. Seriously, people, I want to be at work all day working on you, making sure your head, neck, shoulders are feeling better and everything else putting needles in people, checking tongues, checking pulses. <laughs> but here we go. Liza's got a little bit of neck tension today. Um, so a lot of neck tension comes from the shoulders. Um, so I want to use this AMA technique with circular digital pressure. Um, I'm going along the, the first, the clavicle and the first ribs here. So just little circles with the with the fingers all along the clavicle. Do that a couple times. First one side and then the other. Just loosening up those muscle attachments and I'm gonna take my thumbs and same thing, little circles underneath the clavicle both sides down just like a half inch repeat hands circular digital in between each of these kind of intercostal muscles here on the top so this opens up the chest it helps to ease the breathing loosen up the shoulders um, all right so I'm kind of just gripping like this over the shoulders and gently with my, like my whole shoulder is giving a little push down side to side to see the tension and then I'm raising up with my thumbs up into the shoulder here to kind of jostle that upper trapezius. All right, so next I'm gonna take my hands, cup them underneath the neck and I like to kind of bring that hair back and then grip underneath. So I'm cupping the head with this hand and then the other one just below that with the neck. Hold and support that and just, Liza, you can just like let your head relax back. Let go of that tension. And then after a few breaths like that, you can switch sides. That's just releasing the fascia on the other side a little bit differently couple breaths and then I like to kind of glide up the neck with both these fingers kind of tucking them in just a little bit in the neck until it comes all the way to the occiput and this thumb can go around the ears Then I'm coming underneath, so I'm still gripping the occiput. I'm coming underneath um, with the other hand, and I'm going to hold this hand, and I'm going to circle with this one all along underneath this ear, from the ear to the middle part of the head at the occiput. Slightly turning her head in the opposite direction. Turning it the other way, switching hands. Noticing any areas of extra tightness and I just wanna spend a couple extra circles in that spot. And then again, bringing the fingers, the neck to the occiput and stretching it out. You got a bun in your hair, so that makes it a little, 
You can also loosen up the neck from the forehead. So just thumbs, um, this part of the thumb flat on the forehead, gliding them up one after the other, straight up the midline. Then when you get to the top of the forehead at the hairline, coming across, eyebrows to hairline together, and then across, and kind of continue working your way down to the eyebrows. A little bit of kind of, I just like to go back and forth. You can also do circular. Circles is probably more appropriate, but at this point I maybe get a little lazy and just do back and forth, back and forth, back and forth. And then come in underneath here where there's a little bit of a hollow um, between the sternocleidomastoid and the upper trapezius, gallbladder 20, and just give that a little bit of a massage. And then press in top of the shoulder. Just pressing straight down. Deep breath. And then I'm gonna kind of sandwich her shoulder in between these two hands, press, pressing down with this hand. Again, circulating, circling, <laughs> circular digital pressure along that, just under that clavicle area. And then this is a more gentle pressure and then lifting up with the other one on the upper trapezius. I kind of lift and press with my thenar eminence. Um, along that upper trapezius. So, not sure if you can still see that. So, pressing down, lifting up. Okay. Go ahead and sit up and is there any areas where there's still tension? No. 